Hey guys, what's up? It's Z-Man6776 here. And uh, today we got quite an interesting video here. And um, I, I, I just assumed that one of the big YouTube channels would have uploaded something about this. But um, from what I've seen from my subscription box, no one has really talked about this. Um, there's some more channels that are around my size that have talked about this. But um, not no one really big from at least what I've seen. Maybe someone has. But um, anyways, today we have... Activision video of the new graphics that we will be seeing in um, the next gen consoles PS4 and Xbox 720 and um, I'll just let you have a look at them right now as they pop up on the screen so these are the graphics I was talking about it is property of Activision publishing blah 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 so it is the real deal and uh, as you can see these graphics are basically as good as we've ever seen a video game come close to realism in terms of that and if you look through the video I don't think it's up right now but when they close up to his eyes you can just see the detail in the eyes and the wrinkles and just it is just amazing how far uh, video games has come and but uh, before you guys get your hopes up I don't think we'll be seeing these type of graphics in games like Call of Duty um, or any first person shooter for that matter. I think these graphics will be, if that, these graphics will be in maybe cutscenes of Call of Duty. I don't even think that the cutscenes of Call of Duty will have um, amazing graphics like this. I think these graphics, um, it's it's really hard to say, say uh, <laughs> it's really hard to see where these graphics will show up and what games they will uh, show up in. I, I just don't think that um, Treyarch and Infinity are, are going to put these type of graphics in their games because I mean these graphics have to take up so much memory um, so to put uh, to dedicate a lot of the game's memory into just graphics and facial features stuff that isn't really core into a first-person shooter just seems kind of stupid um, unless you know these next-gen consoles can handle these graphics like a piece of cake like maybe not even close to any memory but uh, I don't see that happening so I don't think these graphics will pop up in Call of Duty. I think these graphics will maybe be for games like... I I, I couldn't even give you what <laughs> where these graphics would show up. They're so good. But um, my final word is I don't think we'll see these graphics in Call of Duty. However, we will see these gra some maybe a dumbed-down version of these graphics in Call of Duty. It's just a, it's so interesting to see what these new uh, consoles will handle. So um, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next time.